Hi everyone, my name is Tony Willey and welcome to another exciting episode of Skyrim Special Edition Mod Tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to take UUNP Vanilla Body Slide SSE and install it in Mod Organizer 2 for Body Slide in Outfit Studio. But I'm also going to show you how to convert the UUNP itself to the um, new Body Slide so you can use the, the UUNP Body uh, itself and actually build it in Body Slide for Mod Organizer 2 for Skyrim Special Edition. Now, you're going to need two mods, and I'll be leaving the links in this section down below. You're going to need the old body slide from the old Skyrim. You're going to need to download that, and you're only going to download it to your data folder. Okay, and I'll show you that in a moment. And next, you're going to make sure that I have another video I will leave in the link, link below, and at the end of this video to show you basically how to download and install body slide from Mod Organizer 2 for Skyrim Special Edition, along with CBBE. I'm going to show you how you can have CBBE and UUMP both installed for Body Slide for Mod Organizer 2, along with uh, clothing that you can shape for yourself. Now, the author has stated that you do not also, if you need if you have immersive armors, there's already a mod for this one that you can download, and she left links in the description down below here. You can install them if you'd like. Okay. Now, this also includes physics, but I'm going to we're going to focus on the non-physics one. I'm going to show you how to add physics to Skyrim Special Edition through Mod Organizer 2 in another video for both CBBE and UUNP. Okay, but first things first, we're going to start with the basics. Now, you want to make sure you download Body Slide to your download folder and make sure you do it manually. Okay, and this is for the old Skyrim Legendary Edition. You need this one because this is the one that has the UN the United. Unified UNP slider set that you need and there's only two particular files you need from this one So that's all you're gonna for, for your Skyrim special edition Okay, make sure you do have the new body slide installed Also, please make sure if you're using these tools that you endorse all of them including the old Skyrim and you, you endorse the mod author uh, Shiva 182 for the UUNP vanilla outfits body slide SE Okay, uh, for creating the, the this mod and the hard work that they put in. Make sure you already have Body Slide installed. And um, once we're done with this, I'm going to show you how to install uh, this one accordingly. The you, you know, UUNP Vanilla Outfits SE 1.14 by Shiva. You can install manually to your uh, Skyrim Special Edition mod, uh, mod organizer. Mod organizer 2. So when you go to download it, just install it like you normally would. This to, to the mod manager. Body slide is it, uh, for Skyrim Special Edition. That's the one you want, so go ahead and do that one. You're gonna what you're gonna do is you're gonna lower this one, and you're gonna get out of here once you've downloaded everything. You're gonna open up a folder. You're gonna right click and open up a new tab on your download folder. Put this over here on the side. Now you're gonna go to your Skyrim Special Edition directory. So we'll go through this, the normal steps. You're gonna find your Steam folder. Go through there. Go to Steam Apps, Common, Skyrim Special Edition. Mod Organizer directory that I've showed you how to do in a pre another video. I will leave a link for that one as well at the, at the end of the, at the end of this video. You're going to go to Mods and you're going to go to your Body Slide that you installed, which was the S for um, Skyrim Switch, version 4.4 SE. That's the one you want. Click Open here. Click Body Slide and this and just leave it as it is here. In your download folder, look for the Body the the Body Slide version 4.4. Okay. Dot seven. This is the Skyrim old version of Body Slide. This has the slider sets for you, you and P, which is what you want. Click Extract Files, click OK. Also, fair warning before we do this. The mod author of Body Slide does not recommend that you do this. This is completely on your own. Do not ask Onius or Caliente for, or Jeer for any help on doing this. This is completely on your own. You can ask me for some help, but I but please follow this guide. I'm going to try to go as slowly as possible in this next process to give you to hopefully help you understand what you need to do and where to drop these files. Okay, I will help. I, I will try to help you, but there's no guarantees. Make that very clear. There's no guarantees that this will work. But we're going to do this. This is this is the process that we're going to follow. Okay, you're in, now on this section. You're in your mod organizer too. Your body slide version 4.4 SE that you created, okay? You went through Caliente and you went through your body slide. It's in this section. In your download folder, as you see here, you've opened up the body slide on this one for the old Skyrim. Make sure it, it says, when you download it from manually, it says old Skyrim, okay? I know I'm repeating myself a lot, but some people can get confused. This is a confusing process. So, and I'm not saying you're dumb, I just want to make sure you have the exact thing right. Okay, now we're going to go over here. We're going to come over here. 
We're going to go to our downloads. We're going to go to our body slide in the download folder. You want two files. I'm going to I'm going to highlight these. Body slide and UUNP. All this other stuff does not matter. Okay, make that very clear. Race menu is an alpha, but these are not going to work for your race menu right now. Now, when they do, you may, you might be able to check into these and, and do the same process of dropping them over into this. But for right now, the only thing you want are the UUNP and the body slide. Okay, f first things first, we're going to start with body slide. Zero, zero, body slide. See it right here? We're going to go into it. It's going to say Caliente's tools. Do not worry. You do not need the textures. You want the tools. Body slide. Do not worry about these. There's nothing in them. I'm going to go up through each one and show you. Shape data. Nothing. These you do want, okay? So we're going to go. You're going to be in here. So it's body slide. Zero, zero, body slide, caliente, and body slide. Under shape data, you want this. You're going to go to your shape data, right? You'll see references here. You're going to drag and drop. You're going to... Uh, copy these over here or you can drag and drop them whatever you choose to do okay they're in here that's what you want now back out of the of the se one back out of here go to conversion sets on your sky special edition body slide go to conversion sets drag and drop or you can copy and paste done Back out of this one. Back out of your Sky Special Edition first. So you're in your, you're back in this folder. Now you're gonna back out of, uh, go back to your download folder. See, it says downloads. That's how you know. Back out of it. Make sure you're back on here. Now you're gonna go to your zero, two, U U N P folder. That's zero, two, U U N P folder. Click on it. Click on Caliente's tools. Click on body slide. Click on your shape data. Click on your shape data. Now go back to your uh, Sky Special Edition body slide. Click on the shape data, and you're going to copy the U United U uh, U U N P. Copy, paste. You know it's working when you have everything looking like this. Click back out of it now, and now go back to your download folder and back out of that. Now what you're going to do is do is drag, copy all these, and you're going to copy and you're going to drop them. You're done. I'm dead serious. It's that simple. Click your categories. You know, you notified UMPs. They're awesome. Categories. There it is. Awesome. Presets. They're awesome. Slider sets. They're awesome. All right. We're going to click out of here. Click out of there. Now we're going to open up our mod organizer. You do not need to worry. It's already in the body slide tool. Now, here's the kicker with this. You can still use the CBB one that you made from the other video I showed you. Okay, it's in this tool. I'm going to open it right now and show you. As you can see, it's all CBB. Now, UUNPK, all the presets, everything you want. Now, let's say I want to do tools. I want to do clothing. So you're going to download that uh, the, the vanilla UMP body. You're going to install it like you normally would. It'll load its thing and install it. Once it's installed, you're going to go find it. It's going to be right here near your bottom under your unchecked. Make sure you categorize it under models and tools or clothing. All right, now if you want to install the clothing, all you have to do, okay, let's go down here or go to your clothing, right, where we put that. It'll be under UMP Vanilla Outfits, Body Slide SE, and click Clothing. Click Check. Now your clothing is installed. I'm using, uh, make sure though when you're using UNP you have textures installed for UUNP. Okay, and I'm going to show you this in body slide. So when you're going to create your body, right, you have a clothing installed. You have all your clothing so you can build one by one or you can do the batch builds like you normally would. Okay. When you do your batch builds, you're going to make sure that if you're using non-HDT, like you don't have any physics installed, you're going you're gonna to make sure that the HD, all the HDT and during your batch build are turned off. You're going to have to go one by one, and it's going to be very, very tedious all the way down. And you're also going to turn off whatever body you have when you do your batch build. I usually prefer to build my body uh, separate from the batch build. Okay, but you can build it from the batch build too if you want. I just recommend not. But make sure when you do your batch build, you have your preset ready to go. Let's say, let's, let's see, Leto. And you have all your sliders set where you want it. 
do not touch them because if you do a batch build and you do it and you remove your sliders after you've already built your body, you'll mess up your uh, your your armors, which you don't want to do. To see textures uh, as you all normally would for your bodies and stuff, we're gonna go to um, that renewed just to show you the body for UEU and P. There's no textures because I have it on the Monorganizer override folder. But if you want to see textures like you normally would, you're going to go to Game File Path, click Browse, click on Special Edition, click Data Folder. That's the special Skyrim Special Edition directory. And you can follow your steps wherever your Steam folder is. You just follow the normal steps up here. Okay, click Select. Click OK. Check Preview. Remember, if you have the textures on here and you build and you build the body, it'll go straight to the Data Folder. On your game path, if you want to build your body to avoid touching your data folder, you go to your special edition here. You can go down to your mod organizer directory, and then you go to your um, override folder. That's it. When you do your batch build, you can do the same thing, and it'll uh, and it'll build the bodies and everything you want to do in the batch build. Click OK, and you can do all that. And then you can, like I said, build your hands and build your feet like you normally would. So we'll just I'll just do a quick preview for a body for you. We'll build later real quick under Never Dude. We'll go build. Make sure that the preview is there. Okay, yep, it's going to go to the override folder. Click build that. We're going to go to hands. We're going to build that. We're going to go to feet. Build that. And then we're going to go to batch build as well. And then I'll go through the process of doing all this. Right now, I'm not going to worry about this. I'm just going to do a quick... I'm just going to undo the bodies. I'm not worried about the physics. I just want to show you what it looks like, okay? But don't do what I'm doing right now. Make sure either... If you're using physics... Use the physics armors. If you're not using physics, use the non-physics armor. It's very simple. Okay? And we're gonna do it, we're gonna do a quick batch build with this, just to kind of give you an idea of what it's gonna look like in your override folder. So just to make sure if you're doing non-physics, you're turning the HT, it'll say HDT, turn those off. Like you'll go one at a time. It'll it'll be very tedious, but make sure everything's correct working correctly. Otherwise your game will crash. So we'll just now again we're gonna we're gonna go to build. Yes. So it looks like it, it popped up telling me if I want to um, do the non-HDT. Okay, so it looks like everything's working non-HDT-wise. Great. So I, I'll just click, click OK, and then it'll, it'll build all the batches. All right, so once we build our, we've built our body and we've built our armors. Okay, so click OK. Then we're going to click down here. And now we're going to go to our override folder down here in Mod Organizer 2. Click on it. Click on Meshes. And now you can see all the body and armor has been installed correctly. Okay. Click Exit. You're going to write create a mod, so we're going to go UUNP uh, Lado Body and Clothing. That's usually what I do, just so I don't get confused with my other bodies that I create. It's going to be down here. And there you have it. Okay, it's that simple to use. Now, if you want to install, now, if you want to build a CBB body, you can do it, too, from the same mod organizer. But you got to have CBB installed through that mod. So you can have both. I'll show you real quick when you're building your body. But you can't have both textures and both bodies built at the same time. So you have to choose between this one or the CBB. But you can still see all of the slider sets in Skyrim Special Edition. So right here, you can see the uh, the bodies right here. But let me get rid of these textures here. So but you need to get rid of the clothing though, okay? But you can have both body sets if you want. The UUNP is already in your body slide, but the CBB is here. So let me show you real quick. We'll go to data path so you can see the textures click OK go to preview now you can click up here and there's CVB there's UUNP and CVB in the same the same body slide set okay I don't recommend having the clothes activated it's a lot of sliders as you guys can see okay you have physics up here you have UUNP all the way down here but yeah you can have every single slider set in, in, in a body slide I just recommend keeping one at a time okay and uh, I'll show you CBB real quick. I can show you the uh, the body. So you can see it in here. Uh, we're going to do Never Nude. Preview. And there's the body for CBBE. And then we'll do Never Nude um, for UUNP again. You can see that. You ha you can have both of them in, in the body slide, okay? As you can see, both of them are in body slide. They look really nice. Okay? Everything's looking pretty. No big deal. All right, guys. That, however, you want to make sure that the CVB physics are not on if you're building the. Uh, if you're going to build the body for UNP because the problem is you can see the texture outlining here. That's for CVB specifically. That's why you need specific texture sets for UUNP if you're going to build the body with that. Okay, guys. All right, guys. That's it for my video. If you guys like my uh, like my videos, please go ahead and uh, like and share with your friends.
you guys like my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. Once again, my name is Tony Ole. Thank you for the click, and I will see you next time.